All right, it's on page 205. Claude, come to my assistance. The Lord may haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Fear 
the lands of the giants should turn to evil. Do good, Lord, to those who are good, to be upright and far. But the crooked and those who do evil, drive them away on Israel.
from the letter of St. James. My brothers, count it pure joy when you are involved in every sort of trial. Realize that when your faith is tested, this makes for endurance. Let endurance come to its perfection so that you may be fully mature and lacking in nothing. If any of you is without wisdom, let him ask it from the God who gives generously and ungrudgingly to all, and it will be given him. Yet he must ask in faith, never doubting. For the doubter is like the surf, drawn, tossed and driven by the wind. A man of this sort, devious and erratic in all that he does, must not expect to receive anything from the Lord. Where 
sin abounds, grace abounds all the more. Forgive us our transgressions. Lord, we have sinned, yet we have also acknowledged your infinite mercy. Bring us to conversion. Save your people from their sins, Lord. Make them pleasing to you. Pray for all those who have entrusted themselves to our prayer. For all of our friends, relatives, and benefactors. For all those who have passed away. Pray also for Rita. Thanksgiving for two new hires we need. You opened paradise to the thief who believed in you. Do not close the gates of heaven to the faithful departed. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Let us pray. Grant, we pray, Almighty God, that just as we celebrate the heavenly birthday of the Bishop St. Bonaventure, we may benefit from his great learning and constantly imitate the ardor of his charity. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your Spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Be always with God and also with our brothers and sisters. Martyrology of July 16th, Memorial of Our Lady of Mount Carmel. The Holy Scriptures celebrate the beauty of Carmel, where the prophet Elijah defended the purity of Israel's faith in the living God. At the time of the crusade, some Christian hermits chose to lead a contemplative life on this holy mountain, not far from Nazareth, where the Virgin Mary had lived, while keeping the word of God in her heart. These hermits' request for a rule of life from the Patriarch of Jerusalem was the origin of the Carmelite Order. It quickly spread throughout Western Europe, where, without a loss to their contemplative vocation, the brothers began to do apostolic work. Heavenly, elsewhere in the heavenly birth of numerous other saints whose names are inscribed in the Book of Life. We fly to thy patronage, oh, Holy Mother, Mother of God, despise not our petitions and our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers, O glorious and blessed virgin. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she could run the Holy Spirit. Behold the hand of the Lord. You have done unto me according to thy word. And the word was made flesh. And dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, most holy Mother of God, that thy may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. For for the beseech thee, O Lord, thy grace into our hearts, that we, whom the incarnation of Christ, thy Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection, through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen.